Secretary for the start of those National Senior Certificate examinations today. Over 200 and 1,000 full-time and part-time candidates will sit for these exams in the province. This, of course, is the largest number nationally. It's also the largest number writing in the province in the last six years. So the exams running from today until the 7th of December. And uh, the MEC for Education in KwaZulu-Natal, Kwasi Mshengu, is expected to monitor the start of exams in Kwamashu. Let's cross over to uh, Kwamashu right now. It's been a long journey with most of these learners obviously experiencing a number of difficulties. Uh, some because of family challenges, um, but we all know that also COVID-19 has been negatively impacting on our sector. Uh, the grade 12 of this, of this year could not finish the curriculum when they were in grade 11 uh, last year. So they came into grade 12 with some learning gaps. So as we were preparing ourselves, we had to close those learning gaps while also making sure that we cover the entire curriculum uh, of grade 12. We are happy that uh, we think we managed uh, to, to cover that, uh, that particular aspect. We have been also emphatic to our learners to say this 12-year long journey that we have been traveling, uh, taking a number of twists and turns, uh, encountering and conquering a number of difficulties, can be messed up in the final hours if these learners decide to do wrong things in the examination rooms and compromise the integrity and credibility of these exams. So we are saying to them, don't bring anything into the exam room that is not allowed. Uh, don't compromise the exam's credibility and integrity. No cheating, no coping. All we want for them is to study thoroughly and be prepared for all the, the papers uh, being assisted by the educators uh, themselves. We'll continue to monitor the exams until the last paper. We'll be going all uh, across the province, but I'm also assisted by my colleagues in the Executive Council and those who are in the legislature. They will also be visiting a number of schools to ensure that um, everything goes according to plan. Our more than 6,000 in trained invigilators are also all over uh, the 1,700 uh, examination centers just to make sure that uh, there's nothing that goes uh, wrong with, with regard to, to this examination. Thank you so much, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, thank you very much, MEC. That was a mouthful. Uh, I don't know if there will be one or two uh, follow-up questions. Just a last one. Just a last one. Well, that was the MEC for education in KwaZulu-Natal. And... Uh,